Alright, hi everyone, welcome to the stream. Good evening, hope you're all feeling good tonight. I'm feeling fine myself. And uh, yeah, kind of feeling in the mood to play some more Pokemon Snap. New Pokemon Snap. I still don't like that title. Like, I I'm just not really a fan of like Nintendo putting you at the front of everything these days. I mean, I was fine with it with New Super Mario Brothers, but then there was like, I don't know, several other games. Like, there was even a console that they put the word new in front of, New 3DS. Like, come on, Nintendo, please stop doing that. I know this is a this is not technically a Nintendo game. It is a Pokemon Company slash Game Freak game. But they still fall under the Nintendo umbrella, so I'm going to call it a Nintendo thing. But yeah, that that uh, that ramble aside, I'm, I'm looking forward to playing more of this because I really enjoyed... Even though I made barely any progress in like two and a half hours of playing it, I really fucking enjoyed playing this, so let's continue. Oh, so I may need to adjust the volume a little bit on this game because it's much quieter than the 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 switch itself. Like the switch interface is much louder than the game you might notice. So get ready for that. Like when I save my photos, you might hear like super loud clicks compared to how the, the game itself sounds. Like at maximum volume it's relatively quiet. I I don't understand that, but that's how that's how the game is. Thanks. Right, so we unlocked a new area. I haven't checked it out yet, so we're just going to jump straight into it. I'm going to take some photos of Poggies. So we unlocked a new continent. Bulls... Belus... Belusevia? Belu... <laughs> I'm terrible at reading these. Belusa... Belusilva? Is that how you say it? Oh god, it's like learning to speak phonetically with Mel now. Uh, Belus, Belus, Belusi, Belusilva, Belusilva. You know what I should do, actually? Hang on, hang on. You know what I should do? Google.com. Belusilva. Can Google speak this to me? How, how do you get Google to, like, you know, read things out for you? To, how to pronounce Bill of Silver? I, I don't... Does anyone know how you do this? One second, hang on. Text to speech Google. Right, here we go. Text to speech Google. Uh, Cloud.google.com. Oh, wait a minute, this isn't what I'm looking for. Uh, give me one. So, sorry for halting the game. I, I am genuinely curious to see how text-to-speech would render this. Fuck Google. Google's not helping. Right, free text-to-speech. Right, let's see if this works. Right, let's see. Does this work? Hang on a second. Bellu Silva. Bellu Silva. Bellu Silva. Oh, so that's really loud, but yeah, that's apparently how you say it. Right, okay, let's get to the game now. Sorry for making you guys wait. Right, so, Fonja, Fonja Jungle. A sweet scent of fruits and plants envelops this verdant jungle. Oh, right. right, so we've got the daytime area. Uh, we'll get the nighttime after this, I'm assuming, and then eventually we will get to see the Illumina Pokemon. So, last time I said that this game is anywhere between 15 to 35 hours, that's what I was told by some person. I forgot who said it to me. I have since checked how long to beat.com. They say that it takes about 9.5 to 10 hours, which sounds a bit more in line with what I was thinking of. But maybe it's like for completion stuff, like it takes about 15 to 35 hours, who knows. Oh, iPhone. How do I throw apples again? It's there. I'm going to quickly change the camera settings because I feel like the camera is not going fast enough. 
Like in that situation just there, it was like kind like the, the bird was like out running or out flying. Wait a minute. Ten. How do you save that? Oh, it saved right, okay, good. Actually, no, wait, it was eight, sorry. Like I said it from six to eight, I think. Uh, we'll set it to nine, actually. Let's let's try that. Beautify. Got 50 pixels left. I better not get too trigger happy with my photos. There's a crystal balloon. Picky peck. Is that what those things are called? The birds? Yeah, the woodpeckers. Oh. Oh. Arbok. Like, you know how Pokemon say their names in the English version of the anime? Like, they, they say, for example, Pikachu or Raichu or whatever. For some reason, Arbok doesn't say Arbok. It goes, Chabaka! Does anyone remember that from the old anime? Because I do. Here, have an apple. It's on the house. Oh, it went, it went and ran away. I mean, I got a look at its face at least, so that might get me some points. Oh, Quagsire. Shit. Turn around, Quagsire. Yeah, there must be some way to get its attention, but throwing apples is not the way. I guess pester balls or something is how you do that. Oh. Whoop. Oh, it's that. Right. Lipards. That's a Generation 5 Pokemon. There's another one. See the Quagsire back there, just it's back turned to me. So I've watched some more episodes of Pokemon Journeys. I'm going to save that part of my, my talking points tonight for when I play Pokemon Black 2. Right, that's a good shot. I think that will get me a lot of points. Fills up the entire frame that's right in the middle. Oh, there's more Quagsire. Oh, I could have gotten a shot of that looking at me. Take the apple. I'm probably missing a bunch of stuff right now. Oh, so I only have like nine shots left. Where did that other Quagsire go? I think it jumped in the water. Get back in the water! I can kind of see his face. The exclamation mark gives you information. Yeah, it was just telling me about the crystal balloon, like I've seen that already. <laughs> I love how derpy this thing looks. What generation was this generation 2? Johto, this one. I love how derpy its face is. Ugh. I want to get a shot of hitting it with the apple. God, that thing just does not respond to me, does it? Oh, it's the end of the level. I didn't get, I didn't see a lot of Pokemon there. They were all probably hiding in the trees or grass. I have to be a bit more vigilant of what I see in the environment. Of course, leveling up your, your trainer experience also makes more things happen, so I guess I need to do that as well. 
I only took seven Pokemon pictures. I hope most of them I can get platinum on, let's see. I barely saw Bone Sweet. Go for that two star. There's a two star here. That's a good one. We'll do that. We got a three star in here. One, two. So one is pecking, two is flying. And I guess three is like looking, like noticing you before it flies away. Yeah, we'll go we'll go with that, even though it's like quite far away. Best to get that banked. Right, we've got a one. Right, so one is flying around, two is looking at me, noticing me. And I guess maybe that's like coming toward me. I'm, I'm not sure what the difference is between this and this. Maybe this one is more of hovering and this one's like, you know, moving from point A to point B. Because this one kind of looks like it's floating in the same spot. But yeah, we'll go with that one. Right, we just got one star for this. I kind of I like the side view on that, like that's kind of perfect, like you can see it just peeking behind the grass there. That one's also kind of good. Again, it's obscured by the, the fauna, but you can see it. Uh, I'm going to go with this one. I kind of like the framing of this one better, but I don't know if this is going to yield more points than this one. But my gut's telling me to go for this one, so I'm going to pick that. And here's all the quagsire at the ends. Yeah, I'll go with that one. Right, I'm going to go with that two star. We'll go with... Uh... Yeah, that, that one I feel is going to get big points. And then the Crystal Bloom. Right, evaluation time. Let's see what we got. I remember in the Pokemon Black and White anime, what was the name of that dude that was like the gym leader that like joins Ash? I forgot his name, he had like green hair. And then in like almost every episode he would be like, It's evaluation time! And he's got the voice of like the four kids Sonic because it's the same voice actor. What was his name again? I forgot. It's been so long since I've watched that version of the anime. Oh, by the way, I should probably mention this now. Hang on a second. So, look what I've got, look what I've done since the last time I streamed this. This is from my soundboard program. I have actually put these on my soundboard, so now I can either do... You were close. Or... Wonderful. So let's 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 make use of that. Nice work. Like I saw someone in chat, like Penguin Lady said, "You were close," and that was that made me remember. Oh right, I put that on my soundboards. Right, so let's see, Bone Sweets. You were close. I didn't even get like silver for that one, so I'm considering that one kind of a, a flop. A new discovery. Right, okay, so eye palm. I think this one might be a gold. Oh, size is perfect. Oh nice. Wonderful. Wonderful. A new discovery. Right, peaky pick. Size is gonna be horrible for this one. Yeah. You were close. Okay. A new discovery. If I get anything less than gold, I'm just gonna say you were close, I guess. I mean, silver is fine, but I would prefer to get gold or platinum. Of course, platinum better, being better than gold, but gold I would consider above average in this game. Great timing. I think the size for this one might be perfect. Okay, well, it's not perfect, but it's still quite good. Nice. Wonderful. That's a wonderful from me. A new discovery. Nice work. Doesn't look too bad. Oh, uh, never mind. I, I can't math on the fly. You were close. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna keep using this soundboard, but I do, I do want to use it for now just because it's fun. Discovery. This one I think might be good for a one-star pose. 
size is nearly perfect. Oh, nice platinum. Wonderful. And then this one I could see being a, a platinum. Like the size I would think would be very close to two thousands. Yeah, there, that's the platinum. Wonderful. Excellent. Right, well, I didn't capture a lot of Pokemon, but I did get a bunch of Platinums there, which is fantastic. Or, should I say, WONDERFUL! More Wonderfuls than you were close. Mm -hmm. Our research in this spot is just getting started. I'm sure you'll be more than up to the task. But if you almost got Platinum, I guess I would say Wonderful anyway, because again, gold is bit, like, above average in my eyes. Silver and bronze, I would say you were close because they're like kind of below average. I remember. By the way, if you like, I can start uploading standout photos for you. They deserve to be seen widely. Photos I upload would be added to your collection online on your page. They'd be marked as my favorites. By the way, you can change whether you'd like me to do this by going into the settings and turning auto upload photos on or off. Uh, let's see, which ones do I want to keep? Oh, I can't zoom out any further than this. It doesn't look too bad, actually, yeah. Oh! I didn't fucking see that slacking there! Right, okay then, well, next time I go past that part, I'm gonna take a picture of slacking. See if I can get its attention. Let me just get this in frame. There we go. Yeah, beautiful eye is staring into your soul. This one I like. Gonna have the apple in the shot as well. I love that if you're not like 100% happy with like the, the framing of your shot, you can like re-snap it. That's a really good feature to have. And then lastly, this one, which we're going to zoom in a little bit for this one. Yeah, there you go. Nice shiny, nice shiny Quagsire. Right, so I'm assuming I've got access to the nighttime one now. Hi. Here. Uh, not yet, but I think I can do one more run and then maybe we can get it. Uh, before we do that though... Actually, you know what? Now let's just get started. Right, let's go. Nope, that doesn't do anything. Oh. I didn't see that before. 
But I did take a picture of that also, there's slacking. Somehow I did not see that the last time. Ah oh, shit! I didn't get a good shot at it there, I did that too late. You know what? We're restarting that, I'm not doing the entire level having just started it. Like if it was near the end, I'd just say fuck it, I'll get it next time, but we, we just literally started the level and yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing like the entire like three minutes of this, only to like go back and do that again. That's a good shot. Out of the way. Nice. That's a pretty good shot. That wasn't a very good shot though. Just got to keep a sharp eye out for whatever I can see. Yeah, there's that crystal bloom. We've seen this already. Oh, that that's a yellow one. Okay, that's different from the blue one we saw. Almost hit it on the heads. Maybe a two star, just hitting it. Even if it's not looking at me, the size might still be good. Some fruit seems to have fallen out of Picky Pick's food storage. There's Lipard again. These ancient runes are being engulfed by an enormous tree. Interesting. I should look behind me in case there's something back there. I think I saw a bone suite, but I can't see it now. Gonna go for I think that's a one star pose possibly. Whoops, wrong button. Good shot though. Maybe if I throw an apple into the waterfall, something will happen. Maybe if I just throw apples into the water. Oh, there's a magic cart. Magikarp, please. I didn't know Magikarp could eat fruit. Some good shots there. Any Pokemon over here? See if I can lure any out before we go to the goal. Oh, there's another Crystal Bloom. I guess there'll be an item later in the game that you can use to make use of the crystal blooms. It's time. Yeah, I don't see any other Pokemon left unless there's some up there. Nope, I think that's everything. Yeah, I didn't get m that much more. I mean, I got the Slacking. The Slacking will get me a bunch of points. And hopefully enough experience to level up my trainer experience. My trainer level.
Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys, the last time I streamed this I briefly mentioned that I got like some physical stuff with my pre-order of the game. It's not much, it's like a poster and like uh, a set of stickers, but I'm going to show you guys what it was because I did take a picture of it but I forgot to like share it, so here it is. Sorry if the pictures look a little bit yellow, the halogen light makes everything look kind of yellowish, but yeah. these are That's the sticker set that came with my physical copy of the game. So it's just like a few stickers, that's all it is. And here is one side of the poster. It's basically just a, like a really big like render of the box art, which looks really nice. And on the other side of the poster is this nice artwork. Really like this. There's one thing about the poster that bugs me though. The poster has a weird smell to it. It smells like paint. Like I'm not I'm not sure how to describe it, but it's like kind of a really weird smell to it. Like it doesn't smell like when you first take it out of the 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 would you call it the plastic wrapping, you really like the smell really hits you. But now I don't notice it so much, but if you like, you know, smell the poster up close, you definitely smell it again. It's a very fucking weird thing. I, I don't know what it is, but that was something that I noticed with that thing. It was like, oh, this is a nice poster. I take it out of the, the plastic and it's like, eh. No, oh, there's a one star. We haven't banked that yet, so we're going to go with that. Bone sweets. I banked a two star previously. They're all two stars. Oh, wait, there's a one star in here. Uh, not, not the best picture, but I'll bank it anyway. Magikarp. They're all three stars. That one's slightly off-center, but I do like that I caught it with its mouth open. Any other ones where I caught it with its mouth open? No, that's that's the only one. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with that one. Slightly off-center, but I do like that I got that particular frame. You can go for one or two. Uh, I'm gonna go for a one. See, I don't know if I'll get, I, I might get penalised a little bit because it's like, you know, facing away from me. But, um, the size looks pretty good. I don't know if it's too big, like it might be covering too much of the screen. This one might be a bit more in line with what they want for size. I'll go, I'll go with that one. Slacking, here we go, so, three star. I'm guessing one star is just like taking a picture of him when he's lying down, not doing anything. Uh, I'll go with this one. This one looks good. Just two stars this time. I like how I got the apple in the picture there as well as I was throwing it. So we've got a two star, which I think was me hitting it. Yeah, this was me hitting it with the apple. And then we'll get a one star here, which is that one. Right, there we go. That should be enough to get a level up, I think. Let's see the results. It's evaluation time! Size is good. Wonderful. Oh wait, that's that's so I looked at the number and I thought that was gold, but no, gold's a little bit more. I think gold is thirty five hundred, not three thousand. You were close. But still that's a decent score, I guess, for what it is. Size is good for that one. But still You were close. I mean, considering how far away that was, the, sc the, the 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 size score was higher than I was expecting, but it was still not even silver. Great timing. Wonderful. Yeah, I think it's thirty five hundred that gets you gold. Four thousand is what gets you the platinum. Mm. Nice work. All right. Size is good. 
you were close. Nearly got the gold there, not quite. This one I could see being a platinum. It's like big, it's center frame, it's doing a pose, it's got it's got the whole package. Nice work. Size is a little weak though. No, I, I thought I would do better than that, to be honest. You were close. That's a shame. Mm. Nice work. This one might do well because of the group. Even if the size is a little bit on the weak side, nah. You were close. Mm. Nice work. How's this one gonna shape up? Ah, uh, not quite. You were close. Getting a lot of you were closes right now with this one. This one I think might be platinum because nice it's work. like center frame and everything. Yeah, size is almost perfect. Nice. Wonderful. At least I finished with a wonderful. Could have been worse, but it could have been better. I think I've got enough to get research level two. There it is. All right. Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in this area are getting comfortable with oh. you. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. I hope it's a new upgrade. Either that or it'll be the night time stage. I don't even need to re-snap this in all honesty, I'll just save it. Does anyone remember that episode of Pokemon from the, the Kanto season? where uh, Ash and crew, like, come across Todd. And there's this, like, kind of a misunderstanding where he's, like, really obsessed with trying to take a picture of Pikachu in particular. And the reason that he was doing that was because Team Rocket, like, was telling him, please capture Pikachu. And they, they were saying, obviously, like, you know, kidnap him. But what he thought they were saying was take a picture of him in your, like, you know, photograph thing, your little camera. So, yeah, that, that was kind of a fun episode. I like that one. Also, for some reason, I, I don't know if this was, like, a worldwide thing or whatever, but when I watched that episode as a kid, they redubbed it to change the name of Todd to Snap. So, when I watched that uh, episode growing up, he said his name was Snap and not Todd. And it, was, it wasn't until, like, several years later that I found out that Todd was, like, his actual name. Which is bizarre. I wonder if he will return in the anime. I mean, it could show up at some point. Who knows? He is in... Like, he did He did show up, like, a couple episodes later for, like, another thing. Like, where they go to that one... Was it, again, it was, like, the place where you go to, like... Take, like, a, a Pokemon examination or something. And if you, like, pass, you get access to the Pokemon League instantly. And that's, that's, the, like, that's the part with, like, the infamous scene about, like... Please identify the silhouette of this Pokemon... And everybody is like, oh, it's a Voltorb, it's an Electrode, it's like a round Pokemon. And then the answer was like a Jigglypuff scene from above. <laughs> it's like a big, you know, like, fuck you moment. But I love it. Let's see, can I angle this in such a way that I can get more of them in the frame? I think I can. Sometimes I'll angle the shots just so I can get more of them in the frame at once. Yeah, that's pretty good. I like that. I'm not going to do that for every single photo, just for the ones that I like in particular. This one I'm going to re-snap so I can keep. This one looks pretty good. Oh, that's weird. Look at the particle effects. The particle effects kind of move differently from the rest of the camera view. That's bizarre. You see that? See how the water's kind of like moving in weird ways? Right, so I'm, I'm gonna angle that like that so we can get more of Magikarp in the frame. 
again this like do it retaking the photos doesn't add anything to your points this is just for fun and if you want to like save the picture to put on your switch later so you can get then share it with like i don't know on twitter or something Also, I know it's the start of uh, May now, and I st I'm still using that dead Mario picture from last month. I should change that. In fact, you know what? Hang on a minute. I've got an idea. I've got the perfect idea for what to replace that with. I need to first locate where the image is so I can replace it. Yeah, here it is. Right, so... I've got, like, a good idea. If you'll give me one minute. I don't know if this will be permanent or if this will just be temporary, but I kind of want to do this. Just because I enjoyed this picture so much. Uh, one second, I need to full screen this so I can get the exact... I have to like stretch it just right so it doesn't, you know, overflow to the, the rest of the, the layout, if that makes sense. Probably doesn't, don't mind me. Let me do that. Alright, and then we move that up a tiny bit. There we go. That's that's perfect. <laughs> right, we'll go with that for now. We'll have that little I don't know, like apple face Pichu thing there in the corner. Did I take a picture of this? I don't know if I did. There might be two of these now. Right, let's return to camp. I need to clear out some of the photos that I've been taking so far. Because I don't think I've deleted any of the ones I've got at the moment, and I'm filling up the space quickly. Alright, All right, cutscene time. Or, well, not cutscene, but just like dialogue to move the story forward. Looks like you're finding your feet on this new island. It's about time I gave you your next, what? next task. What? Oh, what is it? What is it? I'd like you to visit a jungle during the night and photograph a crystal bloom glowing in the dark. Huh? What's a crystal bloom? So I, I don't like this kid already. I'm going to give him an obnoxious voice. Oh, um. It's a type of flower that gives off light. Do you remember seeing any odd flowers out there? Yeah. Oh yeah, I did. Red ones. Mm -hmm. That's probably the type we're after. If you see one that lit up at night, it's what it's it's in what we call the illuminate illumina. The, I'm, I really have difficulty reading that word. Illumina state. Hmm. Do we need to do anything special if we find one? Not particularly. Just snap a photo of it. I mean, I took a picture of that like the last time, Professor. What happened to that picture? Did you just throw that one in the trash or something? Your camera can analyze nice. it for you. That should be all you need to know for now. Enjoy the nighttime jungle. Right, okay, nighttime now. So we'll see some different Pokemon. Uh, let me go and clear out some of my stuff. Hang on. I'm going to delete some of the older pictures that I've taken so I can make room for new ones. It was in here, wasn't it? Yeah, here it is, album. Yeah, I did take a picture of that one twice. So, let's see... Delete multiple. Right, here we go. I guess I'll keep that one. I'm just going to get rid of most of these, just so I've got room for, you know, more stuff. Because I only have, like, so much room here to contain. Yeah, I'll keep that. Well, I still want to get rid of. Guess I can get a better one of Apom doing that. Oh wait, we're we're not gonna delete those ones yet because I need to convert them. I forgot you have to like convert them first, and then I can delete those ones. So we'll keep the newest ones there, but we'll delete that because we did that twice. Uh, let's see what else. Anything else? Uh, no, I'll delete those ones. Right, okay. There we go. Yeah. 
You know what's kind of annoying, and I didn't find this out until after the last stream? When you save your pixels, it puts this in the corner. Like, you see that there? Hang on. Yeah, it, put, it puts that in the corner. Like, I get why they did that, but sometimes it can kind of cover up part of the shot if it's a certain picture. So it's a little bit annoying to do that. I wish there was, like, some way to remove that watermark. I mean, for the most part, it doesn't get in the way. But there will be times where you just wish that wasn't even there to begin with. Oh, shit. Didn't mean to cancel that. Alright, okay, I'm done with housekeeping. Let's continue. Thanks. Right now for the nighttime level. Right, so I know where the crystal is, so I'm just going to look out for that and take a picture of it along the way. I guess we're not going to be evaluated, we just need to get a picture of it, that's all we're doing. And, of course, taking pictures of Pokemon while we're doing that. So, Vinny started playing this game, I noticed. Like, he posted, like, he's been posting a few down. videos on his Full Sauce channel. So, he's not, he's not streaming at the moment, but he is, like, posting content at least. Would you? Oh. I was hoping that would have got his attention there. But I only watched a little bit of him playing this game because predictably he got further than I did in his one session than I did in my one session. So I only watched like the first hour of it, like up to when he got Todd in the cutscene. When he unlocked this level. Just so I didn't, you know, get spoiled or anything, because I didn't want to like see more uh, Morlo. Is that like a mushroom? <laughs> like, I can't move the camera any lower than that. Yeah, we're gonna turn that up to 10. We're gonna turn the point of speed up to 7. Yeah, it's a little bit faster, and I can double the speed by using two analog sticks. Ooh, Ariados. There's the Crystal Bloom. Got it. Let me just make sure that was in center frame. There. Lydian. I'm assuming that's a three star right there. More Eredos. Or Ariados. I'm not, I'm not sure how he pronounced that one. I don't know how to pronounce a lot of Pokemon names. Is that I saw something sneaking, I think. Oh. I didn't catch what that was, sadly. A lot more Morlows. I think we're going a different way this time.
Oh. The Quagsire has, I'm assuming, eaten the, the berry. Oh, camera, please. Yan Mega. What generation is Yan Mega again? Because I don't remember which one that came from. Was that black and white or was that before that? Gen 4. Where did the Quagsire go? Oh, there it is. Nice face. See if I can get his full body in the shot. There we go, that's a good one. I think that's pretty much everything. Yep, that's everything. Alright, not bad. It's evaluation time. Well, after I pick my photos, it will be. So yeah, the dude from Pokemon Black and White Anime, his name was Cyrus. Hello. But yeah, it was like, the funniest thing about him was not so much his personality, it was just that he was voiced by... Fuck, what's the dude called again? The guy from 4Kids? Uh, Jason Griffith, who voiced Sonic in Sonic X and, like, you know, some of the games around that time. So, whenever he speaked, I, I just couldn't fucking unhear Sonic's voice. It really fucking took me out of the show, just listening to that. Like, you could take Cyrus's lines and just dub them into an episode of Sonic X and you'd be none the wiser. Just get Sonic, like, saying, It's evaluation time! Yeah, so I only have one stars. Don't think it's going to be as good as my platinum, but I'll pick one anyway since I have to. Right, well, I got a three star there. Area dose. I'm not sure what makes this one a two star. Maybe I hit it with an apple or something, but it's kind of a not good picture. So I'm just going to go get a one star instead, even though this is kind of far away. At least you can see more of this one. Uh, we'll go for the side view. That one looks the biggest. Oh, no phone. Fuck off phone. Fuck off. I didn't say that. Sorry, my phone thought I said, you know what, the thing that makes it like turn on and like think I'm like asking it for something. Like sometimes when I say the letters okay, sometimes I'll say like a word like before that and sometimes it will think I'm saying, not before it, sorry, afterwards. I'm going to try something. Hang on. Google OK. Right, OK. It doesn't trigger when I say that. So basically, if I say Google OK, but I say it backwards, like I say the OK first and then the Google word second, it will turn on and try to, like, you know, read my voice and search for something. I, I don't know, like, I guess I said something that sounded similar to the word Google. I don't know why I did that. That was annoying. Anyway, let's back to this. I would say it's a pretty good two star, we'll go with that. Lydian. These are all two stars. Hey now, you're a two star. I feel like I made that joke the last time I streamed this game.
one. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that one. Again, we got a three star here. Wait a minute. Oh, I see. This is quite far away. I don't think this is going to be any better, to be honest, but since I have to pick a photo, I'll just pick that one. And then the crystal balloon, which I don't need to show him. I think he'll just look at that after he's done with evaluating the rest. Now that. Right, so I don't think this is going to be any good. Nice work. I think it'll be like 2,000 or something. The size is still good, though. Placement is perfect. Oh, okay. Wonderful. I mean, I don't know if I like that one better. I'm surprised that's a platinum, to be honest. But I'll tell you what, I took a picture of like another one that was like lying down doing like a different face, so it'd be redundant to have two of them. I'm gonna go with this one. There you go. Just for a bit of variety, I guess. Right, so this one I could see being a platinum. It's like almost perfectly in the middle. Nice work. Oh yeah, size is perfect. Nice. Wonderful. It's a three-star platinum bank. Area dose. A new discovery. Nice Let's see work. what we got here. Size is okay. Yeah, this won't be. I mean, it's still a gold. Wonderful. Barely scraped by gold there. I'll take it. A new discovery. This could be potentially platinum. This one looks pretty nice centered. Oh yeah, size is nearly perfect. That was almost 5,000, holy shit. Wonderful. Quite happy with that. Lydian. This one might be a bit too close to the camera. Nice work. Yeah, size got a little bit penalized for that one. But I still got gold, so wonderful. I'll, I'll give that a wonderful. Nice work. I think this will be a platinum. This one looks good. Oh, nearly. Wonderful. I was just short of that. I mean, I guess I could also say you were close because I was close to platinum. You were close. Nice work. This one will be kind of sucky. Yeah, I didn't think so. You were close. I was really hoping for that Quagsire, like Illumin Illumini thing. Illuminati. I was hoping for that Quagsire to be like a platinum, like I was like 30 points away from it. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry, my throat got itchy there. I need to take a drink of water. There we go. You know when you just get randomly you get like a, a, a ticklish feeling in the back of your throat and you just have to like cough? That just happened right now. Right, okay, I need to photograph. I need you to photograph a crystal bloom glowing in the jungle at night. What they learn from this photo will help me m make something important. Okay, so apparently an upgrade is coming my way then, since I did that.
All right, moving on. You need to take a photo of the crystal bloom next, next to the Pokemon. I thought you just wanted the picture of the crystal bloom by itself. You mind? I mean, yeah, it says it there. Could you get a photo of a crystal bloom going in the jungle at night? Unless he means like the one near the Whoa. end of the of the thing. I guess I'll do that. I thought you meant just any of them, not the that specific one. Take care. Any Pokemon behind me? Nope. Oh. I see an Arbok up there. Wrong button. I love it when I press the, the scan button and not the capture button. Didn't see that Arbok before. Yeah, I think I'll get level 2 from this. Thought I had something there. Did I? Wait a minute. I feel like there's something over there, but I'm not sure what. That's a good shot. What was that? Toe Cannon? That's a Sun and Moon Pokemon, isn't it? I think I remember that one. I didn't get a good look at it, but I remember I remember the name of it. I've been listening to the Pokemon Sun and Moon soundtrack uh, lately, if you couldn't tell by the fact that I started tonight's pre-stream with the Team Skull battle music. That game's got a really good soundtrack, like I forgot how good that game's music was. It's just a shame that it was on the D the 3DS, which kind of bit crushed the audio a little bit, so it doesn't sound the best. But all things considered, it's a pretty good soundtrack all around. One of the better Pokemon soundtracks in my opinion. It's up there with like black and white. I should probably throw some of these fruits, see if I can get any Pokemon to come out of the grass. Is this the Crystal Bloom that they want me to take a picture of? Oh, that one.
missed it. Oh, hey there, green. Oops, that's all your memory. Wrap it up and come on back. I'm assuming I was just wasting my camera there just so I could end that quicker. Because I think when you reach zero photos, you just automatically end the level. Right, let's see what we got then. I don't think I got any new Pokemon pictures, except for two cannon, but that was a really bad picture. I didn't get a good one of that. This one might be slightly better. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I'll go I'll go with that one. Arbok. Just a one star. I got a two star in here. I think that was when I used my scanner to get its attention. Oh, it's in the distance, right. <laughs> that picture's gonna be shite, but I'll bank it anyway just for the for the one star I guess, and I'll get a better one later. This one might be more in line with the size and placement. Placement not so much, but size is probably gonna be perfect with that one or close enough to it. That looks a bit better. Yeah, two cannon. I, c I couldn't really get a good shot of this one. Like, I, ca I can't even see where in the picture it is. I think it's like just below the middle, like slightly downward from like the very center of the picture. I, I can't even see where it is. But the game picked it up, so I'm going to pick that photo and see what happens. Yeah, and Mega. Yeah, I can barely... I can see it. It just kind of blends into the environment in this one. So this one's not going to be very good. But it's a one star, but... Uh, I guess I'll pick that one, since that one's like almost center frame. I'm going to see if I can get a Platinum on Quagsile this time. And then the crystal bloom, which again, pretty sure I took a picture of that, but I can't do anything with it. Let's do this. Did I mess up on the crystal bloom again? Nice work. Oh, perfect size. Nice. Wonderful. Keeping that. Size is nearly perfect. Nice. Wonderful. Barely scraped a platinum on Arbok. Keeping that. There we go. Is this nice one any work. better? Oh wait, this one I don't have two stars on previously. You were close. Again, if I get silver or bronze, I'm just gonna say you were close. Nice work. Yeah, this one's kind of shit. You were close. But at least I banked that into my album. Nice work. This one I could see being better because this one's a bit more center frame and not like up close and personal. Yeah, the size is way better on that. Wonderful. It's not quite platinum, but I'll take it. See, that's what I was trying to do, MSP. I was trying to take a picture of the Crystal Bloom and not the Quagsire, but the game registered it as a Quagsire picture, which annoys me because they're like right next to each other. Great timing. Like, if you watch back, you'll see me like zooming in on the Crystal Bloom and trying to take a picture of that specifically, but I still missed somehow. Yeah, this is better. Nice. Wonderful. Right, Toe Cannon, um, where is it in this picture? Because I can't fucking see it. Nice work. 
Yeah, it's gonna be shit. Not even two thousand points. You were close. But at least I can say I got a one star on the album now, and that's a new Pokemon I can look out for. Nice work. You were close. Nice work. I think this one may be a little bit better since it's not like as close as the other one. I think this might be close to 2000 on the size. Yep, that's perfect. Yes, there we go. Wonderful. God, that feels good. This game delivers plenty of dopamine hits that I really enjoy. I'm gonna try something. Where was that two cannon at? Yeah, here it is. Uh, let's see, resnap. I want to see if I can see where it was. Oh yeah, there it is. There was like one flying by that I was trying to take a picture of, but I didn't see. Is that two cannon as well? Like just that one sitting there? I didn't even see that when I was like going by. But yeah, the one I was trying to take a picture of was this one right here. Like you can see its face just peeking out. And let me look at the other one. I think it's off to the left there. I can see a bit of, like, orange. Yeah, there it is. There's, like, two of them there, I think. There's, like, three of them. Really have to get a picture of that one. I'll have to be more vigilant trying to get it next time. Uh, I'm not going to save any of these. Right, so we're going to go back into that level again because I need to grab that picture of the crystal bloom. Bit annoyed that it didn't register that during that second trip, so I'm going to have to make one more trip around. Thanks. This time I'm going to take like 20 pixels and make sure at least one of them ends up being the crystal bloom. You know what would be nice for a situation like this? The ability to speed up my Neo 1. Oh, what, is that a Leafeon at the front? I think I saw a Leafeon right at the front of me there. Look at this. Yeah, things have changed a little bit here. Could have been wrong, but I, I thought that it is a Leafeon. Yeah, because its tail is quite distinct. Right, so that's a new Pokemon to look out for. Oh, Ariados. There's a uh, Charbaka. Charbaka! Eat the apple, please. <laughs> I like how it still detected Leafeon, even though I can't fucking see it. Yeah, we'll just claim all these, like, big, tall leaves are Leafeon. Oh, that's a Swampert, I think. Or Marsh Stomp, whatever you call that one. Let me hit it. Shit. I'm bad at aiming my, my fluff fruits apples. I'm just going to call them apples, because that's what they look like. Hit it! Oh.
Really? I missed? There. No, I don't think that's coming out. Maybe you have to hit it a few times to get it out, or you need the pester ball. Right, that token should be flying by here, or did I miss it? Yeah, there is. There's another one. There's a couple of them. At least I got a better picture of it. What if I hit this one that's next to the Lipert? What would that do? Hang on. I was hoping it would do Stun Spore and, you know, paralyze the, the, the Lipards. Maybe I would get like a 4 star shot or something for that, that's what I was thinking. Oh. Looks like there's a, wa a way to get behind the waterfall. There's a whooper. What? What? I guess I don't have access to behind the waterfall yet. I guess I need to get an upgrade to get in there. But I can see a bunch of like more walls in there. Out of memory. Let's call that enough research for now. Oh, we're still. Oh, I see. Right. Okay. So yeah. Right. So hopefully, I got a picture of the crystal bloom that time around. At least I got a good shot of Leafy on at the very ends. Mm -hmm. I didn't see this the 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 quagsire. The quagsire disappeared that time. Might be behind the waterfall, possibly. Right. We've got a two star in here. Just hitting it with the apple. You got a one star, two star, and a three star. Three star is with the low berry thing, the crystal berry, whatever it's called. I hope the the leaves that are covering part of his face doesn't like, you know, penalize me here. I don't, I don't know. Actually, this might be better. I think this might be too big. I'm gonna go for the very center shot. I think that one's pretty good. Yeah, we'll go with that. Don't think this will be any goods. One star. I should have thrown an apple in its mouth when its mouth was open. Still two stars. Right now this one I got a bunch of good shots on. Got. I, I can see it. I can just barely see it though. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'd say that's pretty decent. Don't know if that'll be 4,000 decent, but we'll see. And then lastly, which of these do I want? Okay, so I, I guess it doesn't really matter which crystal bloom I take. Like, I actually got a picture of it this time, thank gods. Alright. Good size. Nice got of golds. Wonderful. This one I'm hoping for a platinum, but it might not be close enough to get that. Great timing. If I had to guess the size might be about thirteen hundred, I don't think it'll be two thousands. Oh, seventeen hundred, that's pretty good. Nice. Wonderful. That was perfect. Work. Perfect size. Nice. Wonderful. I'm getting quite good at this. Yeah, we're keeping that. Nice work. Yeah, this one wouldn't be as good. Didn't think so. You were close. Gonna keep that old one, thank you. Perfect timing. Uh I mean it's still a platinum. It's actually slightly better than my old one. Wonderful. Oh, I'll keep the new one, sure. A new discovery. Nice work. Yeah, direction isn't good. You were close. I mean, it's something. I can put it in my album, album at least. So yeah, there it goes. Lydian. Don't know if this will. I don't think this will be a platinum. Nice work. Nope, didn't think so. You were close. Keep that old one, thank you. Nice work. Right, so this one I'm expecting to be at least a gold. Nice. Wonderful. Way better than my last picture. This could potentially be nice platinum. Work. Looking good so far. Nice. Wonderful. Really good picture. This one I'm gonna expect to be a bronze. I don't think this will be any good. <laughs> it's like nice it's obscured by water, it's like really fucking far away. You can barely fucking see it in the picture. Yeah, it's gonna be a bronze. You were close. Great timing. Yeah, this one wouldn't be that good, sadly. You were close. And then finally, the Crystal Bloom. A new discovery. This is the Bog Sylvia Island Crystal Bloom. This is the first time you photographed one in the Illuminator State. Illum Illumina States. If I can get that word. Okay, so it doesn't really evaluate it for you. It just, like, banks it. Right, so I guess my upgrade is about due now. If we make a few more discoveries, we may reach some new frontiers. Krista Bloom Red. It looks orange to me, but okay. You registered Krista uh, Bloom to your photo decks. By the way, now that we've got that Krista Bloom info, I've got something to report. I hope you're excited. Right, let's see what the professor has for us then. You know what? I'm surprised Nintendo didn't implement the Nintendo Labo with this game. Yeah, that seems like a bit of a missed opportunity to do Labo VR for this kind of game, to be honest. I'm not sure why they didn't do that. I guess, it, I mean, ultimately this game isn't made by Nintendo. It's made by the Pokemon company, so I guess it's their call at the end of the day. But still, you would think they would maybe like do some sort of collaboration and be like, you know what, we could 
We could implement Labo VR. I mean, the technology is there. Why not make use of it? Great job. Your photos give us plenty of data to work with. Now then. Now I've got something new to show you. Please take a look. Oh, oh are those the orb thingies you've been working on, Professor? Didn't you say they could make Pokemon and Crystal Blooms glow? Mm -hmm. Exactly. I call them Illumina orbs. Illumina orbs. Unfortunately, blue Illumina orbs only work here on Florio <gasps> Islands. How come? I suspect it's different in different areas of Lento have distinct types of energy flowing through them. Oh, but for now, want to see the fruits of your research in action? Watch this. Right, tutorial time, I okay. guess. Or cutscene time. But yeah, I guess it's just a new throwable thing, you just throw it onto the crystal balloon. Nice. That was awesome! Oh. oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot Todd was in this game for a second. Yeah, he again they really age him up in this game. He's like he's like taller than all the other like kids. I don't even think he's a kid, he's like an adult at this point. But yeah, he's like I don't know, he's like 25 to 30, I guess, now, compared to I mean I guess that would make sense if this game, you know, chronologically takes place like 10-15 years after the original Pokemon Snap, which when did that game come out? Like 20 years ago almost? Or about 2000 and when did Pokemon Snap come out? Was it like 1999, 2000? So yeah, that would be about 20 years. Wow, Lento's very own light show. Well... What did you call it again? The Illumina Phenomenon? It's interesting how it can occur in both Pokemon and plants. Mm -hmm. You can use these orbs to send Pokemon and, cri and Crystal Blooms into the Illumina state for a while. When you do, watch for changes in their surroundings. Can we have some of those orbs to work here on Flo Rio? Yep. Of course you can. Yep. <laughs> We're gonna have to try these out back at the nature park. Alright. So I've got a new item now. So blue ones for Fall Rio and then the red ones. Again, it looks orangey yellow than red, but the red ones will be for the new place. Right, let's continue the research. Yeah. I'm gonna go back to Fall Rio for now so I can try it there. Not sure what button it's mapped to, it might be the Y button. Yep, it's the Y button. Was Pichu so excited about? Oh, okay. Oh. Tangrowth. Pidgeot. I think there's a crest of bloom coming up. I think I see it. There is. Oh shit. some good shots there. That's an excellent shot. I think that could be a, pl a platinum right there.
Can I knock that into the water? Could be a pose. Oh, high score, bunny. Did I? Hmm. I think I, I think I missed it waving. Where did it go? It ran away. Wait a minute. Where was it? Bidoo for finished building the dam. Oh. Sylveon. Cool. Oh, so grookey. I'm terrible at aiming. Like, I want to bop it to see if I can wake it up. I don't have pesta balls yet, so... Apple's like the only thing I've got to work with for now. I'm going to hold off my last 10 photos for this next part because that's where the next uh, Illumina crystal thing is. Crystal balloon. Yeah, there is. Ah. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, there it is. It's time. Oops, that's all your memory. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh no, I didn't see that other one. I, c I could have made that in the Lumina. Shit, next time. I didn't think there was two uh, bloom crystals at the very end. I thought it was just like the one. I didn't pay close enough attention. Like I saw the Vespa Queen and my instinct was just to take photos. Take photos, ask questions oh, later. Whatever. I got, got a picture of Vespa Queen at least, so that's cool. Uh, Buffalon. Uh, where's the Buffalon? <laughs> I don't see it. Right, we got a three star. Yeah, that's it doing its its uh, big kick. We'll go with that one. One star Pichu. This one won't be that good. Yeah, Pidgeot won't be very good either. I don't have a one star one yet, so I guess I'll go with that. Yeah. We'll go with that. Right, so we got one star, two star, and three star. I mean, this picture looks good, but I know the size is going to get penalized because it's a little bit too close to the camera. But fuck it, we'll go with that anyway. I think it will be a decent scoring one. I got like a really good picture of Swanna here. Like that one right there. That could be a platinum. I'll go with that one. It's a little bit further away, but more of its body's in shot. Sylvia and doing fucking jack shit. Lazy fucker. Yeah, we'll do that one. Right, we got a three star here. Yeah, we'll go with that. And then Vespa Queen. Which, if I'd seen that bloom, that bloom crystal thing next to it, I would have done. I would have hit that first, and I would have taken pixels. But whatever, I can do that on my next trip of rounds. 
So I'm guessing Vespa Queen is what the combi evolves into, yeah. I don't know if I want to go with this one or this one. Again, the size might be penalised a little bit because it's a little bit too close. Actually, you know what? I think this one might be... I don't think it'll be 2,000, but it might be like on the upper... I don't know, maybe about 17, 1,800 points, if I had to guess. Right, let's see. It's evaluation time. How did I do? Let's do this. <laughs> I don't even see what the fuck Buffalon is. Is it like that tiny bit at the top left corner? Like I can barely see it. Nice work. How is direction better? Like I can't even see what direction it's facing. But yeah, of course that one's gonna be a. Uh, are close. Predictably, we're gonna keep the old one. Nice work. Nah, this one won't be very good. You were close. Score bunny. Right, this one has to be pretty good. Uh, you were close. I was hoping for at least gold there. I did get a little bit closer, I think. But hey, at least I got three stars. Nice work. This one will be shit. Yep. You were close. Keeping the the other one. This one I think will be better. Nice work. Oh wait a minute, I, I don't have a one star yet, but I think this will be good overall. Seems like it's got good size. Yep, it does. Nice. Wonderful. I mean that's way better than my last time growth picture, so I'll take it. This one's gonna be shit. Look, it's been covered by Buffalo. Nice work. You were close. Honestly, I like that old picture better, so nice I'm not work. really too upset about not getting a good one on that. Oh, well, this looks good. Wonderful. It's not quite platinum, but at least it's not silver. Mm. Yeah, I think the size is going to get penalised for this one. I think it's a little bit too close to the camera. Oh, okay then. It's still quite high. Wonderful. I'll take it. I think I'm happy with that. This one, I think it's going to be a platinum. This one looks too good. I mean, I mean, look at the positioning, the framing, like everything about that looks near on perfect. Nice work. Yep, this is looking pretty good. There we go. Wonderful. Barely scraped by platinum by 13 points. I'm very happy about that one. Mm. Nice work. This could be a gold. Yep, it's a gold. Wonderful. I don't know if this one's going to be any better or worse. I mean, the positioning looks better on this one. It's a little bit more uh, center frame, but I don't know. I kind of like the pose of the old one better. Nice work. The pose score is the same, though. Size is better. Everything's better. But it's still silver. You were close. Nah, I honestly like the old picture better, so I'm just gonna stick with that one. A new discovery. A new discovery, and it's fucking dead. I almost got, uh, yeah. You were close. I almost got gold, considering the Sylveon was doing absolutely nothing. I'm guessing Sylveon will show up during the daytime as well, so I'll have to look out for that. Work. Nah. Didn't think so. You were close. I wasn't even trying to take a picture of of Torterra. I was trying to take a picture of the Grookey in front of it. Funny how it didn't register the Grookey. Great timing. This one I think could be a gold at the very least. Uh, not not really. Oh wait a minute, it is right. Okay. I didn't quite get platinum, but I'm happy it got gold, so... Wonderful. I'll mark that as a wonderful. And then finally Vespa Queen. A new discovery. Nice work. This might be a gold. Size is perfect. Yes, it's a platinum. Wonderful. Happy about that. I thought I was going to get penalised for the size, but it was just right. It wasn't too close. Mm -hmm. 
I hope I can unlock the next area soon because I want to check out a new area before, you know, before we move on to the next game. I'm not sure how much more I'll be playing this for tonight because I want to do some Pokemon Black and White for a little bit. Black and White too. Let's see. Any good ones here? I guess the Score Bunny kick in I can save. Let's resnap that one. Even when he's doing an attack, he's so fucking smug. Look at him. Smug ass motherfucker. You'd think me being a fan of Smug Leaf that would like Score Bunny, but I think Score Bunny tries a little bit too hard on the attitude front. I like Sobble better. I'm still waiting for Sobble to show up in this game. I haven't seen it yet. Like, I've seen Score Bunny and Grookey, but no Sobble. I think eventually it will show up, I just don't know where. Uh, I'm gonna save that, that Swana picture, because that one was like almost perfect, so we'll just get a nice close-up of this one. Right, so let's go back to the other place then, uh, whatever it was called, Belisivia or something. Yep. Yep. You can just hit them and you'll get a little bit of like the Illumina thing. Yeah, and Mega just chilling out. Uh, hang on a second, my eyes itchy. I need to uh, deal with that. There we go. Some more Ariados. I think that Leafeon scared them. Did I miss a, a Crystal Bloom Berry, by the way? I didn't pay attention if I missed it. Taking a picture of that. That's it.
Yeah, I think I did miss a crystal bloom. I keep forgetting you can throw the apples or the crystal bloom ball things while you're in aiming mode because my instinct is to like unaim and then throw them. But that no, doesn't work like that. I wonder if that does it. Oh? Oh. I mean... <laughs> I see I see a swampert back there, but I saw the waterfall as well. But the, Not the waterfall, sorry, the, the, the what you call it. The rainbow, which I guess is cool, but I mean, maybe a picture of the the Morlo with the rainbow might give me some points. Hang on a minute, my nose is itchy. Ugh. There we go. Gotta love it when random parts of your face get itchy during stream. That's my favorite. Oh, I I forgot I missed the crystal balloon. Whoops. I can't I can't even see where it is now. Derp. Does the crystal bloom thing work in daytime as well? Yeah. Nice work. It does. Right. Okay. I'll check out the daytime levels then. I'll go back to Florio daytime and then I'll go to this jungle daytime. See if I can get a couple more good pixels. How was it? Right, okay, just one stalls. Wait a minute. Oh, I see. Like, I was looking at the, the compare picture, like this one. And I was like, where the fuck are the Morwell? I see two Ariados, and then I realized, oh, they're in the, the far distance. I like how the game, like, doesn't realize that I was trying to take a picture of Ariados. Like, I didn't even realize there was, like, Morwells back there. Oh, that's a three star. Okay then. Right, well, I got a three star Gan Mega. Got one and two stars. Uh, we'll go with that. Three star area dose. Uh, which one is better though? This one, I'm tempted to say, is a little bit better. But they're both kind of not that good. Yeah, I don't think either of those are going to be better than my my previous shots, but I'll take I'll take one anyway. Yeah, this is quite far away. I don't even so I don't even see exactly where it is. I just know it's back there. 
maybe it's this one. Like, I don't know which one is more in center frame because I can't actually see it. I'm sure there's some way to load it out of the waterfall. I haven't figured that out yet. Right, so this is a one star. Size isn't that big, but it may get me some points for what it's doing. Uh, I'm going to go back to full Rio daytime and then I'm going to do the jungle daytime level 2. I want to use my crystal bloom crystal ball things on the daytime of the first area first. Nice work. Oh, size is near perfect. Excellent. Wonderful. Way better than my last one. This one could be good. Nice work. Oh, it's even better. Wonderful. I'm not sure if them being affected by the the, the 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 alumina crystal things adds to your points. It might do. I didn't pay attention to the, the scoring there to see if that was the case. It might. Wonderful. Mm. Nice work. Size is perfect. Oh, that's going to be a Platinum. Oh no, it's not quite Platinum, but I'll take Wonderful. it. Like, I saw the size and I saw the placement and I thought, yeah, everything else will be at least another uh, thousand together, but it's not. But still, that's that's pretty good. I mean, even though the direction is shit, because, you know, it's like facing away from me, the game still says gold, so that's, that's good. Nice work. Wonderful. Bone sweet, yeah, this one won't be that good. Nice work. It's too far away. <laughs> one sixteen. You were close. Keeping the old one. Mm. I don't think this one's gonna be any good either. I almost got gold actually. You were close. I'm surprised I got that much out of it. I thought it was going to be like less than 2,000. Nice work. Wonderful. Right, this one I could see being slightly better than the last one. Nice work. Oh, the size is not that good. Okay then. You were close. In that case, I'm just going to say you were close because, yeah, that's not as good as my last one. Nice work. Okay, and still platinum, but wonderful. I think I just like the pose of this one better, so I'll just keep that. Nice work. Right, I think this is going to be better than my last whooper. This one you can actually see a bit more of. You were close. Not even silver though. But I'll, I'll keep the photo for that. There we go. Some platinum, some newer courses. It's all good. Some golds. Mm -hmm. ah. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I wonder if that means the Illumina Pokemon that I need to chase after is going to be showing up now. I'm not going to bother saving any of my pictures there. There's nothing like super special I want to hold on to. <laughs> All right, on to the next site. Oh, we got a new area to explore. Nice. 
guess we're not ready to track down the big Illumina Pokemon of the second region, but we've got the third region now to explore. I pinpointed two teleportation points that we can use. Oh, where? Look. One on this long narrow island and another offshore in the middle of the water. Huh? So wait, I got two places I can check? Captain Vince never got to that spot offshore, did he? That's great! This is gonna be amazing. Lord. I'll let you decide in which order you want to visit them. Keep up the good work. Right, okay then, well, we've got two new areas to check out. I think I'll play this for a bit longer just so I can check them out. How's it going? Enjoying your research, Jaunts? Actually... Listen, I've got to tell you something. There's this feature I originally forgot to suggest to the Professor. But I got him to add it to your research camera. What kind of feature? It's a melody player. Oh, it's kind of like the pokey flute from the first game. Right, that's cool. It lets your camera play a little tune. Mm -hmm. So this will be good for changing Pokemon behaviour. A little music can prompt Pokemon to show you whole new sides of themselves. Wow. Rita. Sounds awesome. Rita, can you fill in on the details? Yeah. Right, okay. Time for the tutorial, I guess. If you play the R button, a melody will play. While it's playing, you can press the R button again to make it stop. A little music would wake up sleeping Pokemon. Or make some Pokemon get up and dance. <laughs> I haven't had a chance to try it, though, so I'm not an expert yet. So next, let's give it a whirl. Right, here we go. Tutorial time. Guess we're testing this on the Pikachu round back. Oh, never mind, we're, ju we're just going to the next level. I mean, I don't need to do a tutorial, I, I know, like, they just told me how to use it. Thanks. But you know, some games can, like, be very tutorial heavy. Blushing Beach Pristine Sands and Pastel Tones make for a serene shoreline. Sweltering Sands, <laughs> I like that name. In this vast desert, Pokemon gather at a small oasis to relax. Uh, I'm gonna do this one first. This one seems fun. We're gonna save Sweltering Sands for after this. Counting on you. There are also requests in the game. How do you access those? How do you view your requests? Is that like challenges? Oh, I see an executor. Warm and relaxing place. I think you're in for some fun photo sessions here. Walking, crab roar. Ooh, I like these Pokemon. Oh, come back, dance for me. Fine, go fuck off then. <laughs> Bastards. Didn't want to give me the time of day. I can hear something, or is it that? Huh. There we go. Shit. Don't you love it when you pull the camera away a little bit too early? Uh, wait a minute, am I supposed to hit this? Hang on, let me get a picture of it in the centre. Right, there we go. I think I've wasted too many of my photos. I'm already down to like 29. Wingo. Is that Puku Muku? Yep, I remember that from Sun and Moon. It's a very weird Pokemon.
Oh, I see. You can you can determine your direction. So next time I do this level, I'll go to the right. You need to take a picture of an active crystal bloom. I don't see one yet. Oh, Stunfisk. Yeah, I'm running out of memory for my camera. There's a Pikachu. Red shovel. Oh, it's a female Pikachu. I only have eight pixels left. Maybe I can get this thing to dance. Or flop about. <laughs> Such a weird looking Pokemon. Oh. Crab Roller. I tried to be a bit more conservative with how many pictures I was taking there because I was running out of film. Otherwise, I would have gone crazy with my shots there. Yeah, I didn't see the crystal bloom. I'm going to keep an eye out for that for next time. Yeah, the two star is the blocking animation. <laughs> just looking at the faces. Like, something about the faces on these things just make me laugh. It's, I think it's like the weird, like, Meowth, like, overbite that they've got, like, the big lips that stick out on the upper lip, if that makes sense. Also, their facial expressions as well, but I think, like, the, the upper lip is what makes it, like, even funnier to me. Yeah, it looks like a good picture. Yeah, we'll go with that. But it's, I got a lot of pictures of Bill Awesome. Yeah, I can see that being a platinum. I only got two pictures of Wingo. This is probably my best one. Puku Muku, which I could only get that far away. My champ. Three star. Oh yeah, that was it. Flexing. Maybe a little bit too close to the camera, but I'll, I'll go with uh, go with that one. Octillery. Three star. That was when I did the scan, I think. One star, two star. Yeah, we'll go with the two star. Um, go with that one. And then lastly, Pikachu. We haven't got a two star yet, so we'll do that. Let's do this. Right. Let's see what we got. A new discovery. This one could potentially be a platinum. It's like pretty big in the center frame, near enough to it. Nice work. Oh yeah, that's almost perfect sizing. Nice. Wonderful. Quite happy with that. This one I think may be platinum as well. This is a really good lay framed picture. Nice work. Perfect size. Wonderful. That's two for two. The awesome. This one may be a tiny bit closer to the camera, but otherwise it looks good. Nice work. Yeah, it's a little bit too close to the camera. But hey, still over 4,000. Excellent. Really happy with that. Wingo. A new discovery. I think this will be better than my last Wingo picture. Or, oh wait, I don't have a previous. I thought I took a picture of that one before. 
Yeah. You were close. I mean, it's still silver, but it could have been better. This one, I think, will be garbage. I think this will be a bronze. Nice work. Yeah, look at the size. Not even. Not even close. You were close. A new discovery. Great timing. Wonderful. I think this will be a platinum. A this one looks pretty good. Goodly framed. Nice yes, goodly. The goodliest. Oh, nearly. Wonderful. Ten points away, but still, that's a gold, so I'll accept that. A new discovery. Perfect timing. You were close. And then, lastly, Pikachu. Nice work. Might be a golds. Nope, silver. You were close. All right. How many points did I get? Oh, nice! I actually got level one on my first try, or one level. Right. I got I got to level two on my first try. And I'll step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in this area are getting comfortable with you. Maybe some of the Puku Muka will be closer to me now, since I only saw them like quite far away. Ah. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. Alright. Let me just quickly organise my photos then. Again, something about the lips. Like, if you look at the one on the left, you can see the lips kind of like sticking out the upper lip, specifically. Also, the one on the right looks like it has a Jay Leno chin going on. Oh, have you guys ever seen? Hang on a second. Let me see if I can find this. So, there's this really weird, like. I don't even know what the context of this is, but there's like this weird series of like official Kirby figurines in Japan. But they change the Kirby characters with one distinctive feature, and I don't know what this is about, but I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. Hang on a second. So for some reason, there's like a series of like several Kirby figurines, but for some reason... Oh, hang on a second. OBS, can I drag that in there? Hang on a second. I had to convert the, the file type so it would work. But yeah, for some reason, there's Kirby figurines that look like this. I don't understand the context of it. Like, they've got gigantic, like, chins. What the fuck? <laughs> like, there's Kirby with, like, a big chin. And then the, the bottom three there, like, King, DDD, Meta Knight. Even fucking Wispy Woods has, like, a giant Jay Leno chin. I, I don't understand it. What is the context of this? Does anybody know what the, what this is supposed to be? I love how Meta Knight has a giant chin on the mask, which is technically not a part of his face to begin with. But I guess the, the mask is designed to have a big chin because he's got a big chin under it. I want to see, like, maskless Meta Knight with a big chin. <laughs> if they're, if they're going to do that, they may as well commit to it. Go all the way. Fucking crazy. Uh, let me get a picture of Blossom here to save. Um... Get a couple pictures, I'll get that one. Just so I've got like two of them in the shot. And I'll get the other one that was like eating the apple, this one here. I'm noticing the shadows look a little bit pixelated though, you see that? Something about the shadows here look kind of like scummy. Yeah, we'll take a picture of that as well. 
Yeah, the shadow, the shadows look kind of shitty here. Like, if you look closely, the shadows are like really pixelated. I don't know why it's rendering it like that. I don't know if it was like that during gameplay or if it's only like that during resnap mode. But it looks really low quality for some reason when you look at the shadowing. Yeah, that's fine. That's all we need. Maricopia Islands. So the Lentil region isn't like one big continent. It's like a series of small islands, which is interesting. Now that. Your research on the beach is coming along well. Seems like you're about ready to move on to the offshore area. By the way, the Neo One can travel over a reef just as well as over a river, after all. Now. Let's get ready for some reef search. I can't believe he made that pun. Okay, so we unlocked nice. yet another new area. Uh, I'm going to be moving on to Pokemon Black too soon, but we'll do one more. We'll do this. And I think I'll save the, the Sweltering Sands for next time. Hmm. I'm glad that I'm seeing a bunch of levels now, because for a while it's just been me doing the same couple levels over and over again. Press, be press Y before you go into Lentil. Too late. Can I... Wait a minute. I, I, let me cancel this. How do I leave? Um, I don't. I didn't see a button to quit. Yeah, for some reason there isn't a button to quit and just go back to the lab. I have to like either play through the level or just waste all my photos. I'm just gonna do this instead. I think this will be quicker. The game auto saves, right? It auto saves after every single uh, thing that you do. At least I'm pretty sure it auto saves. Thanks. Yep, it auto saves, right? That's good. Right, so press Thanks. the Y button, you said. Did you know? Oh, that's how you get to the request, right? Okay, thanks. So what is this? Earlier I saw some executor napping. They look so cute. I was hoping you could get them too. Didn't I take a picture of that sleeping or did I not do that? Like, cause I did see it sleeping at some point. Bill Awesome seemed to react to the scan function. This might help you get a good photo of it. Have you ever seen a Wingo do a loop-de-loop -loop while flying? I bet you can get a good photo of it before you. The way Octillery is eyeing the sand over there. Something is about to happen, I just know it. Okay then. Right, so let's do the reef and then I'm gonna I'm gonna move on to Pokemon Black 2 for a little bit. I do like three hours of this game, but I want to spend more time on Pokemon Black 2 because I think it's gonna be a bunch of grinding tonight to get to the next gym. Since I, I, I was barely able to beat the last gym on that game, I want to make sure I'm like at the right level for the next one. Sharpedo. Makes me want to go for a swim. Finian. Finian Ferb. Did that thing just pop the apple away? I got it with its mouth wide open. That could be a good pose.
So there's a crystal bloom. Oh jeez. There seems to be something hiding inside this big whirlpool. I'm getting some flashbacks of the first game. Oh. the loop de loop all right bye magikarp eventually you'll become a gyarados i guess there's a waylord pelipper mantine yeah, getting some good photos here i like the beach area this is fun I'm imagining the sweltering sands will be a place for fire Pokemon. Fire and potentially ground type because sands. I don't know if I got that loop de loop there in the act. I guess I missed the turn. I was going to go to the right there, but it went to the left. Corsola. And. Marini, which is from Sun and Moon. Oh. Watch out, Corsola. <laughs> Poor Corsola. Here's some more. I'm only down to six photos left, though. Corsola looks like it has a Kirby face on it. Just like a gigantic chin on the front and it'll be perfect. Just a big Jay Leno, a, a big Jay Leno level chin. Right, okay then, so let's see what we got here. Sharpedo, just a one star. That's my best one. Finian. Yeah, I think I think the two star was like it knocking away the apple. Oh. Did I pick the two star there? I think I yeah, I did. Right, Wingo. I think the three star was the loop de loop, but I didn't really get a good shot of it, sadly. I think I'll go for a two star. Yeah, I like that one just with its mouth wide open. This one looks a bit more sent off frame. We'll go with that. Marini. Marini the Mini. Corsola. Again, it looks like it's got a Kirby face on it, if you look.
Yeah, three star is the minute. I don't know if the, I mean, the positioning doesn't look that great, but I do like that the water is splashing on the lens. That might cost, give you extra points. I'm going to go with that one and see what happens. Not that many good Pelippers, relatively speaking. I think this might be the best one, angle-wise. Yeah, we'll go we'll go with that one, sure. I saw like a really good Mantine. Um Yeah, this one. Kinda like that one. That one looks good. Then Machamp, which is one star. Which I don't have yet, so that's good. Nah, I can't I can't show him that yet. I have to wait until night time. Right, evaluation time. Let's see what we got here. I think this one could be a gold. Maybe just short of platinum. It's looking good so far. Oh, nice. I just actually made it. Wonderful. A new discovery. Yeah, this one I think will be silver. Yeah, it might not even be silver. It might be bronze. Yeah. You were close. But hey, I got a new picture for the album. Right, nice next work. up, Wingo. Placement is perfect. You were close. But it's still kinda shit. I could see this one potentially being a platinum. Like it's almost center frame. There's like two more there. It kinda like it's not symmetrical, but it almost is. Uh, nah, maybe it's more... yeah. Like, never mind that. I was thinking that would be a lot better than that actually was. You were close! Didn't even get silver on that one, so... moving on. This might be a gold. Nice work. Nah, not with that size, it's not. It was, cl it was close, though. You were close! It was close to getting a gold, but not, not quite. Nice work. This one will be shit. Yep, that's what I thought. I'm gonna keep the old one. You were close. We lords. Yeah, that's that's not very good, is it? You were close. I hope you guys are not sick of listening to you were close. I won't do that as much next time I play this game. Nice work. All right, three thousands. This one could be good. Work. Nope, it's not really good. I'm just going to fast forward through these. This one might be actually really good. Oh yeah, look at that. That's excellent. Wonderful. So I'm kind of speeding this up. Like I'm, I'm wasting time. If you hold the A button, you can kind of like go through the scoring process a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. Our research in this spot is just getting started. I'm sure you're more than up to the task. Best shot collection, you got a score of 4,000 points or more on a photo evaluation 50 times. Yeah, look at his face. Something about that face I love. Oops. Wrong button. Again, Kirby face. Like, hang on a second. One second here. Bear with me. Like, you could tell me 
that that would be a Kirby face and I would believe you. It looks like a slightly off-center, like off-model Kirby face, but it looks like one. Yeah, now it's even more Kirby-ish. <laughs> yeah, ma maximum Kirby, let's go. We'll stretch it out as far as we can. There we go. Kirby to the max. Didn't Misty have a Corsola, or was it someone else that had a Corsola in the anime? I forgot who had it, I think it was Misty, but I could be wrong. One of the female Tagalongs had it. Misty had it. Which generation was that again? I haven't even seen the faces of the Marinis yet, like they're kind of like obscuring it a little bit. Gen 2. Was Corsola really that far back? I thought that was like a Generation 3 Pokemon. I, don't, I honestly don't remember that one being Gen 2, but if you say so. Right, so probably one more go around through that and I'll get to level 2. Same for the other, uh, other area. But I think I'll save those for next time. Before we stop... What was the last picture I saved? Magikarp eating apple. Just gonna save the other pictures first before we end this. If I can remember where to find it. No, it's not research back. Mm -hmm. Just gonna save these pictures, then we'll move on to Pokemon Black 2 for a little bit. So yeah, Magikarp eating apple, that was the last one. Nope, not that one. Yes. Just some good pictures there, I might look at them later. Oh. Might look at them later and see if I can find the good one for thumbnail purposes. I'm not sure which one to go with just yet. That's the fun of me taking these now, just so I can look at them later and figure out what thumbnail to do. I didn't quite get any funny ones, you know, like the one with the apple with the Pichu's face, but... I mean, the expression on this one might be thumbnail worthy. I'll think about that. Ah, shit. Nope, hang on a second. There, again, I'm just clearing out some of the photos I don't need anymore. Right, okay then, um, we are going to stop here for now. I've still got like one area to check out the, the sweltering sands, but I'm going to save that for next time because that way we can start with a brand new area, unlike today. I mean, today we did, but we were stuck on that area for a while. So I think next time we will save that and then I'm going to go back and check the other area, see if I can get the nighttime versions and we'll take it from there. I guess next time I'll see if I can unlock one of the boss fights, which is what I'm going to be calling them from now on. Like when you have to like track down one giant Illumina Pokemon. So I could see that happening next time. This has been a really fun chill game so far. I've been enjoying it. So yeah, more Poke new Pokemon Snap later this week.